design was actually made by Jing, one of my friends. She's going to Japan so she wanted a nice design on her nails. So she came up with these easy to do pastel nails with the Union Jack and a smiley face as well. Okay, let's get started. Today, we're going to need a few colours. We need a red, a black, a base, a pastel yellow, a deeper yellow, a pastel pink, a pastel blue, a top coat, a dark blue and a white. And if you've got pens, they also come in handy. First of all, let's put our base coat on to protect our natural nails. Then paint our thumb yellow and also the finger next to it on our pinky finger. Then paint your middle finger pink and the finger you've got left paint it a light blue. On your other finger paint your thumb also yellow and your middle finger yellow. and your pinky. Then paint your other finger pink and then the dark blue on your other finger. Paint half of your left hand thumb pink. You can use a dotting tool but I prefer to do it the easy way and just swipe it across with your brush. Put blue onto your middle finger and also onto your pinky. Then using the dark blue, just paint a tiny tip on the top. Then on your right hand thumb, paint the top of your thumb pink. Then we want to paint the bottom of it blue. Then the bottom of your second finger blue as well. Then pink on your pinky finger. Then using the darker yellow, just create a bigger tip than on your other finger. We need more space on the other finger since we'll be writing. Then using a dotting tool, create two small dots and a smiley face. The hard part is the Union Jack. Using either a stripping brush or a dotting tool, just create the lines before we're going to add the red. It doesn't have to be perfect, mine was not neat at all. I think if it's not me a bit messy it gives it a nice design to it, sort of a creative I've done it myself look. Because I don't have a small enough dotting tool I suggest you use a cocktail pick. Then put a white line across the middle of it. Then we've got our Union Jack done. Now this is up to you what you do if you do it in a different language or if you write your name in your own language, but I'm doing it in Chinese.
it might take a few shots, so you might get frustrated. I didn't do it perfect the first time. I also did this design with my name in Korean, which also looked quite good. But I'll be doing it on here in Chinese. Then we put our top coat on. And we're done. Thank you Jing for this lovely design.